A step forward today in New York to right past wrongs. Governor Hochul signing a bill moments ago to create a reparations commission aimed at looking into the persistent and harmful legacy of slavery in this country. Eyewitness News reporter Anthony Carlo live on the Upper West Side with more. Anthony. David, this is an American story. This is a New York story. Governor Hochul's words just moments ago, she says she wants to ensure the children of today right here in this state are not weighed down by the shackles of the past. And Governor Hochul signed that bill to a round of applause just a little while ago here at the New York Historical Society. It effectively creates a community commission to study potential reparations for black New Yorkers. The nine-member commission will study the effects of slavery on the here and now and make recommendations. These recommendations may include compensation, but can also include policy changes. Slavery was made illegal in New York in 1827, but supporters of this bill say a racial wealth gap still persists. White families in the state have a median net worth almost 15 times that of black families, according to the Comptroller. The new commission will study the link between historical racism and current disparities in housing, policing, and income. The governor pointed to the Buffalo mass shooting for those who doubt racism. Racism still exists. White gunman Peyton Gendron allegedly had written on his gun, Here's your reparations, when he shot and killed 10 black New Yorkers in May 2022. The Reverend Al Sharpton says the creation of this commission is not about writing a check, rather about starting to heal the scars. To those who think that even having this conversation is unfair or wrong, I say it would be wrong not to have it. Yeah. Because to bend that arc of justice, we have to be willing to talk about the hard things, right? I want to give credit to this governor for having the audacity and courage <laughs> to do what others wouldn't do. No doubt this is historic. The commission has not yet been convened, but will be created over the next six months. Three members will be appointed by the Assembly, three members appointed by the Senate, and three members appointed by the governor. Once the commission convenes, they'll have a year to draft a report with their recommendations, and then the legislature will have the opportunity to act upon those recommendations. Supporters, if anything, hope that this will spark future change.